वेलकम बैक टू माई YouTube चैनल सो टूडे आई एम गोइंग फॉर अ फूड रिव्यू टू अ प्लेस नेम्ड साउदी और साउथी आई डोंट नो हाउ डू प्रोनाउंस दैट रेस्टोरेंट एग्जैक्टली बट इट्स एट कांडोलिम एंड आई एम ऑन माई वे नाउ सो लेट्स गो साउदी इज लोकेटेड एट कांडोलिम ऑपोजिट नो होटल श्रम्स होटल गोवा इट हैज इट सिटिंग अरेंजमेंट इन साइड एज वेल एज आउटडोर Let me just show you the place. So let's check out the menu card. So this restaurant specializes in South Indian Mangalorean cuisine. So first up I ordered myself a mocktail, the Italian Kiss. This drink is a fusion of kiwi crush, cranberry juice, soda and Sprite. At first I really loved the taste of it. It was chilled, refreshing and tasty. But I didn't quite like the taste of the dark orange thing at the bottom of the glass. Other than that the drink was really nice. The watermelon gives it a nice element. Overall the drink was really delicious. Next up I ordered myself the mutton keema dosa. The mutton keema dosa is served with sambar and chutney. The dosa was stuffed with spicy mutton keema mixed with tomato spices and chili. The keema dosa dipped in the sambar along with the chutney tasted amazing. The keema was thin minced, the spices blended well and it tasted yummy. You should definitely try this dosa at Saudi. They also have various kinds of dosas that that you can try like prawns, chicken, egg, paneer burji, kara masala and many more. Let me just open the dosa and show you guys. Next up I ordered the Malabar paneer tikka. In this dish the paneer is marinated with cardamom and coconut infused yogurt marinade and then cooked in a clay oven The paneer was very soft perfectly marinated there was a mint pudina chutney served with it which blended well with the paneer The tikka had a little gravy to it and the first bite of the paneer literally melted in my mouth. Next up I ordered their kingfish tawa fry. Firstly the fish was very fresh the masala used to tawa fry the fish was tangy sour and spicy it also had the flavor of curry leaves the fish tasted really nice dipped in the pudina chutney served with it the slice was thick and usually i'm not a fish lover but i really like the taste of this For main course I ordered their specialty the Mangalorean chicken curry along with Malabar paratha 
अपम एंड नीर डोसा The appam was very soft just like a dosa and it went really well The neer dosa was very light and made up of rice flour so it was very delicate to even lift it in my hand The mangalorean curry was a little thin but taste wise it was delicious I feel like the mangalorean curry will also taste good along with steamed rice. The chicken in the curry was soft and tender. The malabar paratha was my favorite. It was soft, flaky and went amazingly well with the curry. So for desserts I ordered their akrot halwa. and they suggested i try their mannapuram halwa i absolutely loved this dessert the consistency of the halwa was too good it was gooey creamy and filled with akrot nuts basically i love walnuts so i am a big fan of this dessert it literally tasted like chocolate fudge and i couldn't stop eating this delight It was mouth watering, heavenly and to die for. I highly recommend you guys to try this dessert at Southy. The Mannapuram halwa is made out of rava, ghee and mawa which sounded really creamy and delicious and yes it was absolutely awesome. The texture was slightly smooth and thick with the blended rava and mawa taste. It was piping hot and mouth watering. I'm on my way back home now. I really enjoyed the food at Saudi. It was really very nice. It's pronounced as Saudi, by the way. And I really loved the food. The desserts were amazing. The halwas that I tried, they were to die for. Two good place, great ambience. It's not AC. It has fans, but it was the ambience is quite cool. And in this season right now, which is nice and cool, it's a very nice place to go with your date. and yeah if you guys enjoyed this video you know what to do like it share it with your friends family visit saudi goa and of course subscribe to my channel if you haven't already bye